Hey, what's up guys? It's Nash and welcome to my channel for another episode of My Time at Sandrock. In this series, we have been moving a little bit slowly, but we're just trying to enjoy the game. The sun's coming up, it's a new day, I got all my stamina up, and today I think we should be able to finally make the crane lift. All right, so I believe I'm probably out of fuel on all of these things, these recyclers and whatnots. Copper sticks, okay, we are good there. What do I need? I guess we need to just refuel this. Don't have any power stones. We do have quite a bit of dregs though. So let's use dregs, get that going, and then let's come over here and see what we get. Hopefully we get some bearings. Beautiful. That is what we wanted. And let's just do 10 there. That's nice. Kind of starting off low, but this is what we've been working on. This is the beautiful crane that we are hopefully going to finish today. That's right, guys. All right, let's come on over to just near the copper. Yeah, there we go. We did it. Oh my gosh, everyone's probably finished this within like day one or day two. And here I am so far into the series already. But anyways, I'm taking my sweet time. So we have perfect quality and it looks like in the museum large exhibit we can we can put this in the museum i guess i didn't know about that oh my goodness this looks hilarious oh i officially made the crane yeah that's definitely a crane it's so funny how it gets so small anyways uh okay let's go check the mail and then we are gonna go put this crane down we have to figure out where it goes first but it looks like we got a reply from ma in the mail so glad to hear everything's going swell. Maybe we were worried for nothing. That's part of a mother's job, though. Someone has to worry about you. I guess that's true. So there's no reply to this one, which is fine. Mail was super easy today. Now let's open up our map and check this out and see where we need to take the crane. Okay, so check my mission details. Picking up the slack. Is that where I'm supposed to go? That's the Eufaula salvage. And also here at Construction Junction, there's something. I'm, I'm thinking this is where we need to put the crane. So let's go do that. All right. It definitely looks like this is probably a place that a crane would go if I had to guess. So this is the spot. Are we putting the crane here so that we can go all the way down? Yes. Install. Here we go. Okay, so low quality preferred, high quality preferred, manual. Uh, okay, I guess we're gonna go low quality. I don't know if this makes sense. Check the quality of your item. So we had perfect quality, which I think is fine. So yeah, let's, uh, maybe we can do high quality preferred. I have no idea. Anyways, we are putting this bad boy down. I'm so excited. We're gonna have a crane. I wonder if this is something that we can actually use to like get down further in the salvage yard. There it goes. Hard working builder. That's right. And there's me on helping too. Oh, we did it. This makes me so excited, guys. The crane's in place. Dang, this thing is huge. And it works like a dream. That is exactly what we were hoping for. We did it! We did our first big mission, I gotta, I gotta say. You, those two lifts you made are running like a dream. Looks like Yan finally did something right higher in the two of you. Maybe we don't have to move out of Sand Rock after all. Well, now me and my boys can finally get back into the abandoned ruins and get to work. But we're still way behind on our mining quota. Say, that gives me an idea. You two like diving, don't you? Yes, we do. I want to go diving. I want to see if I can get more resources. Sure we do. Ruin diving is what builders do best. Well, that and building. She's right. I think I got another way we can both help each other out. You want to do some digging? Sure. All right, so here's the deal. The abandoned ruins around here are the pride and joy of Eufala Salvage. They hold precious resources and relics from the old world. They're open to anybody who has the same pass you use to access our salvage yard. Pass fees pay for folks like you to rent a jetpack in case you dig yourself in too deep, and a scanner mm. for finding relics easier. Also, sometimes we gotta hire the Civil Corps to go through from time to time to make sure we don't have any, uh, incidents. You builders can use your pick hammers to dig tunnels through the ruins, and also to break up ores and valuables that you can take back to your workshop to make all kinds of cool stuff. 
Anything's fine as keepers down there. But, uh, I got a little proposition for you. Since the lift's been out of commission for so long, me and my boys are gonna have to break our backs to make up for lost time. If you want to sell me some of the ores you find in the next couple of days, I'd pay you top goals. That sounds like a definite deal. And with that, we're just gonna have to go find them just first. Just something to consider. Well, you enjoy yourselves. Don't mind anything I wouldn't mind. Okay. Oh, I wonder what that is. Uh, what would he not mind? Look at them going to work in the back. Peck, Faye, and Venti are just- Oh, and there's another person too. And Bamna. Oh my gosh, you guys are going hard on this, like, one little area. So, I'm curious about this section. I don't know, we're, we're just gonna have to go go down the crane and see so we can take any crane. One's probably down and one's up. Yeah, okay. Here we go. Oh my god, this is so cool! Whoa. Oh, this is so cool! Okay, so we can officially go in here. And officially, officially go into it's mining time. Officially go into the room. Sorry, I'm so excited. I'm like, I'm speaking ahead of myself. That looked like a drop off. So then we can go up this one or maybe go up, up this one too. I don't know. I'm just looking around, guys. But take the crane lift. You fall salvage abandoned ruins. Okay, so I'm pretty sure we just gotta head on in here. All right, so you're here on level one. We can unlock different levels. That's pretty cool. We can find power stones, copper, a camera. That's pretty cool. Old parts, simple circuits, fish oil, and a golden bull's head. Hmm. All right. Well, I guess we're just going to do it. Let's head into the abandoned ruins. Oh, my word. It's been so long since I've done this, guys, but I am so excited. Look at me. Oh, my word. Look at my outfit. <laughs> It looks almost as silly as uh, my time at Porsche. I love the glasses they give you. They're like the x-ray goggle thingies. All right, so here we go. It looks like, wait, what is this? A vending machine. I mean, that makes sense. It looks like a vending machine. <laughs> I like this art. That's super cool for this. So heat stroke medicine. Whoa, heat stroke medicine, heat stroke medicine. Windmill weather vane piece two or windmill weather vane piece three. Wow, so can I get heat stroke down here? What is happening? Can I jump over this? I can. Oh, look at this. There's copper ore right here. This is super. D oh, I was gonna say this is super, super different. Oh my god, I want to hit that. Yeah, I don't want to hit the ground. This is like different, but the same as Porsche. I am going to compare the games. I know I've been, I've been talking about this for a while now, but I'm going to kind of compare the games. So in Porsche, they didn't have like nodes like this above, but you can see that the ground is different. So this is going to be a copper vein for us. What about these? I don't know what this is, but it looks like we could potentially go off in this direction too. We're just going to have to kind of mine through. Very fun. Okay. I'm getting used to everything. So let's collect up all this copper. We need to get 10 pieces, which we have tons of. So this is not going to be an issue for us. Very nice. There's that. Okay, let's come on over. Collecting up all the copper we can get our hands on. 60 pieces already. 63. And okay, that's good. What is this? Door? Can I do anything? Well, we finished our mission for the day, but I do want to kind of look around. And then do we still have? Yeah. So if you press F, you get the scanner and the scanner is always really fun. Whoa, this is so different. Oh, there's one right here. Okay. So distance is just three down. Oh, I feel like maybe that's a dead end. <laughs> if I'm being honest, I feel like we just ran into something. That's fine. Okay. So if we go this way, whoa, what is this there? That's explosive! Run for your life. Oh my gosh. Okay, that's definitely new. Okay, but there's still so much copper down here. There's like scraps. Power stones. Oh, I need an upgraded one. So that's how you found po find power stones. That's very cool. And then again, we can just kind of come over here and find copper. So do we get copper from the ground now? Ooh, we got a level up. That's what I like to see. So it seems like it's definitely not as deep and you find veins like ore veins instead of 
digging deep down into the ground like you can still dig into the ground but there's really not too it's not too deep is what it's seeming like so i'm not gonna spend too much time here we will be coming back here i'll probably also be doing this in between episodes and just um taking my time with it and, and collecting resources on and off camera for you guys but yeah there's definitely like a little power stone thing so we gotta upgrade my pick hammer asap Let's figure out how to do that. But let's go see if we can talk to Rocky about all of the copper that we found. Because again, we have so much. And if we could get a little bit of money from this, that could be nice for the future. All right, we are taking the crane back up. And we are going to go see if we can talk to Rocky. It looks like he's quite far away. But I'm sure we could find him. So it looks like I have found Rocky. We are all good here. Let's go. Give him a chat and see what he says about the hey, copper thanks, here. Hey, builder. <laughs> I guess you found it all right down there. <laughs> yeah, we definitely This little did. bit will There's go so a long much. way. There's something for your troubles. Like I said, top goals. Holy moly. Why did I get relationship with so many people? That's so cool. Okay, I love it. What about this? This is like news? Dude, can we actually check this? Oh yeah, okay. This is where... So this is the official newspaper of Sandrock, the Tumbleweed Standard. Regular issue, once a month, it will be updated. After major events, you can view the full news here. Okay. Hello, Grace. Newcomer, What's going huh? on? That's good. We need all the help we can get. I haven't I'm Grace. met Grace yet. Stop by for a meal at the saloon sometime. I'll do my best to make something edible. So she works at the saloon. Very interesting. Okay. Pan, mix in cream with salt, add the eggs. Fry for three minutes and 30 seconds. I'm doing everything straight out of the book. Why are my omelets so disliked? I am with you on that one. I try to cook and I feel like I'm decent and then I taste so long, other partner. people's food and I'm like, wow, this is so much better than anything I've ever made. But I feel like I cook okay, but I feel like we're, we're filling each other's pain here. Anyways, we needed to head over to the construction junction and I think there was a quest in here that we needed to complete. Hey there, reckon you got my letter? How's Mason's old shack treating you? If it's not quite what you were expecting, might be high time to start upgrading. If you've got the goals and the materials, I can set you up with a new building for your workshop or upgrade something you've already got. Just take a look at that catalog over there on my desk to see what we're working with. Mm. Oh, also, I've always got plenty of materials stored around here. If you ever want to trade some of yours for mine, just check out the construction junction shop. Super helpful. So I think that that's definitely will want to. Here's to a happier home. We will want to expand later, but I don't know if we really need that right now. I think we have checked out this catalog. This is like the super cool menu where, yeah, you can like come in and you can twist your camera all around and and just kind of add things and get rid of things and do things. <laughs> <laughs> to be honest with you guys, I am not accustomed to this part of the game at all. It's something I definitely want to mess with later, but for right now, we, we just have this little old place and I think it's it's pretty good. Although I can kind of move stuff here. Maybe we should move these to the where this makes a little more sense. Yeah, okay. I think that's good. Look at this scrolling down here. That's I've never seen a game do that before. It's actually super cool. Okay. So I think I'm just going to leave. Yeah, let's confirm that. And then that was pretty much all that we needed to do. We got a lot done today, which is so exciting. Let's give a talk to Jasmine, see what she's up to. She is such a cute little pumpkin. Oh, throw, throw, throw the news gently down the street. Merrily, 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 merrily. Continue on page three. Oh, she's such a sweetheart. So cute. Anyways, let's uh, let's go see. I think we checked out the store here. We don't need to do that. But there is another thing that we need to focus on. We had a quest. So not only do we have this sand hat quest, which I need to find leather and cloth and pigments. I honestly just shouldn't have even taken that one. Hold on. Let's let's do a little bit of backtracking really quickly because if there's a place to get pigments, I'd probably be here. Yes, pigments. Okay, and we have quite a bit of money, so let me check how many of this did I need. We need two pigments, two rough cloth, and basic leather. Okay, so... Oh, gosh. I, how do I... Can I buy things? Oh, there we go. Okay. Can buy things. 60. Oh, my goodness gracious. 
Okay, so I think then it was two of these, right? We're gonna be spending all my money on this, but I do wanna get this commission done. And then three basic leather. Okay, let's do it. Basic leather is right here. My inventory is full? You're joking. It's always full in this game. All right, time to head back home. We will dump off some of my inventory. It looks like I'm gonna have to make a new chest. And then we'll come back. We'll try to get this sand hat thing done. But Burgess, that was the other thing I wanted to talk about. I need to make a weapon for Burgess. And then I think I need to get going on a weapon for myself because we currently do not have one. So that would be super, super good to get on track. Let's get that taken care of. And then we need to refuel this. Kind of running out of drag. So I'm gonna... Well, we're not running out, but I am definitely... Like, okay, I need to be on top of this because if I'm not, that could be an issue. My brain is going a million miles an hour, guys. You can probably tell you're like, this girl's not making any sense. <laughs> but let's do a little autofill. Okay, that would be good. And then we can go back, grab the leather, and then we hopefully can make this hat. Then after we make the hat, we can figure out how to do the swords and stuff. So we need one more rough cloth. Actually, it's um, three instead of two. So we're going to buy another one of those. And then this one was three as well. That didn't take me too far down on my money. I'm really glad that I could buy these things. So we just have to head back home, make this. I hope I have the recipe. I'm sure there's somewhere that I could check if I have the recipe or not, but I, I honestly, I don't know. I'm just gonna go to my bench and see if we can make this work. Okay, here we go. So we just need to make a sand hat. Uh, we've got shoes, casual hats. Oh no, don't tell me we can't make a sand hat. Sand hat, anyone? Anyone? Anywhere? No? Okay, let's do, um, I think this one's all. I'm not feeling, not feeling it happening, guys. But yeah, so we need this stone sword and a shield for the quest. Casual shoes. So I would assume that to make the sand hat, we need to buy it or we need to make it on a different type of machine or like crafting table of some some sort <laughs> um okay well i guess i'm gonna have to figure that out yeah we are definitely in need of another piece of storage how much wood do i have i only have three right now that's not gonna be enough to get us the storage that we need but i can go out and get because uh, I think it's 10, right? Yeah, I can go out and get a little more wood. I'm gonna make this storage. So let's go chopping down some little ferns. So these little ferns give you a pretty good source of wood, these yak thorns. I talked about this in a past episode. They give you lots of fiber, and I think it's like one wood per thorn if you're lucky. Sometimes they don't think they give, but most of the time they do. So it's it's kind of nice to, to go through and do these. I was going out and looking for like those wood piles but they give you wood scraps they don't actually they i think they can give you a piece of wood but most of the time they give you more wood scraps which is not what we're looking for oh my gosh there was a scorpion in there that was spooky <laughs> what the heck okay nine pieces of wood see how fast that was that wasn't too bad at all and there it is we've got our 10 pieces we can head back on over to the house, make another wooden storage, and we are good to go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Inventory's full. I know that's what I'm currently working on. That is what we're working on. Spend 10 goals to unlock a backpack slot. Heck yeah. Do they get more expensive? No, it's just 10 goals each time. That's so nice. We have so many goals. I don't know why I haven't really done this. I'm just going to get this entire bottom row and then we can go even more we can have multiple pages so that's super nice just because it has been a bit of a pain in the butt to do storage in this game but uh, i didn't i don't know why i thought that would be more expensive i thought it'd be like a hundred goals not 10. okay so which way oh gosh i can't i can't see okay that's the back so that would be the front okay awesome look how those connect together that's pretty sweet Okay, mini storage. We're gonna fill this up with, I guess we'll do like natural things in here. So we could do berries, lavender, uh, hmm, cactus fruit, I guess would make sense. Milk, food items, stuff like that. Ooh, wheat seeds, definitely. Oh, I wanna get to gardening. We haven't done that yet. Okay, cactus spike is definitely a natural thing. Dew is a natural thing. Uh, I have pants. 
Seaside casual shorts? Where did I get casual shorts from? I'm super confused. Bone necklace, that's kind of a random thing. I'm definitely gonna have to figure out where all of this goes because I, yeah, yeah, this is so much stuff. Uh, okay, good. Yes, at least my inventory is a little bit less cluttered and I can pick things up now. So that makes me very, very happy. Now, when it comes to the recycler, let's see what else we can get. We have these mechanical scraps. This is going to get us bearings and things like that. I have a feeling we are going to need rubber um, and this kind of stuff soon. And I have a bit of these. So maybe we just go and do five. So, hmm, okay. And then let's fill this up with just a few more dregs. Very good. And then let's get that recycling for tomorrow because I'm probably going to go to sleep and save my game. I feel like we did a lot of good stuff today, so I'm feeling awesome about that. But it is almost time for the end of the day. Okay, we don't have any of that. Don't have any. Let's do get a few more copper scraps going. Get 10 going. And then let's see what we can also get on our furnace. We don't really have any glass. We don't have any bronze. We can always make bricks or we can make some glass. Yeah, let's go ahead and make some glass because we don't have any of that yet. But uh, anyways, guys, that is going to have to do it for this episode of my time at Sandrock. This was a super fantastic episode because we got the crane finished. I have been waiting to do that for such a long time, and I am just feeling really, really good that we got that done. I do need to refuel this really quickly. But again, thank you guys so, so much for watching. I hope you all have a very beautiful, wonderful day, wonderful weekend, what, whatever day you're watching this. I hope that it is the best week ahead um but you guys are awesome i will catch you in the next my time at sandrock episode see you guys